us some good news. A student at Broken Arrows Vanguard Academy is getting a former shelter dog a leg up in life by 3D printing a prosthetic leg. This is really wild. Fox 23's Catherine James joins us live in studio with the story of Kane the dog and that student trying to help. That's right. Here uh, at Broken Arrows Vanguard Academy, they have a class where students are challenged to take on a project that will have an impact in the community. Kane the dog is getting help from a new friend. Broken Arrow Vanguard Academy junior Brooke Tyler wants to outfit Kane with a new prosthetic leg. This is where the dog's able leg will go. This is where the prosthetic will go. Kane lost his leg in an accident when he was only six months old. He was in foster care at the time with the Broken Arrow Rescue Community or Bark. I got a call from the foster saying that there was an accident, so I had to rush him to Animal Emergency Center. When he got there, the vets thought that uh, uh, maybe a wild wild animal had pulled his leg possibly through a fence. Jamie Cope with Bark helped Kane recover from the leg amputation and find his forever home. Now Kane gets around as well as any other dog, but running on only three legs takes a lot of energy. Brooke hopes the new leg allows him to get around with less effort. I feel like there's a lot of people out there that we can help and we don't really realize it. I think there's a lot of animals that need help. It's all thanks to the Vanguard Academy's Explore class. The class is based around creating a project. We create all of it. We go with whatever idea we have. We try to do something big, something maybe to help the community, help Vanguard. Brooke is using the Vanguard Academy's 3D printers to create this prosthetic frame. After trying it on and taking measurements, the piece will be further refined using a more flexible filament. Now, they say creating these prosthetics requires a more expensive, flexible filament for the 3D printers. They say they're looking for a community, to, uh, pardon me, they're looking for a community partner to help out with that cost. Now, if you can help, contact Broken Arrow Public Schools. Reporting live in Tulsa covering news that matters, Catherine James, Fox 23 News.